Hey doll friends, this is Zambi with Little Plastic Friends and it's almost comical how many times I have recorded this video. Don't let anyone tell you that doing voiceovers is easy. This is crazy town over here. Okay, we're doing a Smart Doll Collection video and I'm gonna start off with my pair girls um, and then we'll go through some different groupings. So this is this right here is my future in cinnamon. She's adorable. Look at the freckles. Oh my god. Okay, this is me, myself, and I in the tea skin. And she is my newest doll. So the pair girls are very different, just so you know. They are heavier, they are more costly. Uh, the clothes probably tend to cost a little bit more, though they can wear some American Girl doll stuff. So that's handy because there's a ton of 18 inch doll clothes out there. Um, I did want to point out though that Future is supposed to be kind of like a semi-real, I say kind of like, I think she's supposed to be a semi-real version of Mirai who was the very first doll that Smart Doll or Danny Chu released. Um, and then I did want to say me, myself and I and T, she is my latest doll. So I just think she's beautiful. I couldn't resist the purple hair and purple eyes, let's be honest. Um, so they're just super cute. I only have two. I'm hoping to add an anime version at some point in the future. So this group, you've got Liberty, The Moon is Made of Cheese, and Prowess, and they're all in Coco. And um, they're all really, really cute. So, Prowess was actually the third doll I ever got, and um, I think she's, I just, I just think she's adorable, and I would love to have every single version of Prowess that they ever release under the sun, because she's just one of my favorites. So, we'll focus on The Moon is Made of Cheese. She is a newer sculpt, and she seems to me like she's almost like an updated Chitose sculpt. Um or like an, a Chitose multiverse sculpt. This is Liberty. Liberty is not wearing her original wig. She is in a new wig that I put her in and I just think it looks perfect on her and I think she is beautiful. So there are some new wigs coming up. I'll try to point them out as we get to them. Here's my girl. Here is my prowess, my very first prowess. Oh, love her so much. So here's a group shot of the girls. They're adorable. <clears throat> and I'm just super happy with them. And let's see, this is, um, this is Fortitude and Kizuna. Fortitude on the left and Kizuna on the right. Fortitude is a tea skin doll. Kizuna is a milk skin doll. And I will tell you, Kizuna was the very first doll I ever got. Um, and she is in milk. I was so happy to get her because it was discontinued shortly thereafter. This is Fortitude, and Fortitude is absolutely one of the prettiest dolls. I just think she has such a sweet, sweet, sweet expression. So she's kind of a hippie in my group. I got a few hippies in my group. I love them. Okay, this group, we have Prowess, Mirai, and Chitose Multiverse. So you can see um, Mirai, always a favorite. I love her. I'm so sorry that it took me so long to get her. If you are into anime dolls, you definitely should add her to your collection. I think that she is adorable. She is the first release. I kick myself for not getting an original Mirai. The original ones came with outfits. She came with a little magnetic um, hair barrette. Oof, she's so cute. So, so cute. Just the sweetest little face, sweetest little expression. And as soon as I got her, I just, like I said, I kind of kicked myself for not doing it earlier. So this is Chitose Multiverse. And the original Chitose had the bigger, rounder anime eyes. And I would love if he would release that version again. Please, 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 please. Um... And then this is Prowess. Prowess was my second doll. She's in the cinnamon. And 
like I said, I would love to have every single version of prowess. Every single stinking version of prowess. What was it? Orange stripes, blue stripes. Of course, I want the prowess, uh, the proud prowess in the anime version, but she's, she's on my list. Okay, this group, we've got Melody, we've got Valiant, and we've got Journey. Okay, so you can see right there we've got Valiant on the left and Journey on the right. And on the left here is Melody. Melody is one of the first ones that I, I wanted her for a long time. She was kind of one of an early, early smart dolls. But I only recently actually got her. So this is Valiant. And Valiant I call Marshall. She's also in a non-stock wig. Um, I call her Marshall because I took a picture of her with my Marshall speaker. <laughs> so she's literally the only doll that has a name. So here's a close-up of Melody. She is my other little hippie doll. I love her. And I just think she's super cute. This is Journey. Journey was one of those dolls that I did not hesitate on. As soon as she popped up, I just thought... I looked at her face with that little blush between her eyes, the little blush on her cheeks, and that little highlight on her lower lip. And I love short-haired dolls, so... I didn't hesitate when she actually came out. I think I ordered her as soon as I saw her. So, okay. So this group, this is my Proud Prowess and my Monday T. Proud Prowess is in cinnamon on the left. Monday T is on the right. Um, and I, I don't know, what do you say? I just think these two are super cute. And I think Monday T was actually the first semi reel that he released and it had to do with the nose holes. So that was, that's what distinguishes the anime from the semi-reels. So just really cute girls. So, okay. So this group, we've got Courage, Legion, and Transcendence. So Courage on the left, uh, Legion on the right, and the Cocoa Skin. Transcendence is my vampire girl. So Transcendence is in a different wig. She came in like a gray wig originally, but I just... I feel like she just needs to wear black all the time. I think she's great. Um, as far as uh, Legion goes, everybody loves Legion. And then Courage is one that I looked at for a really long time. And could I just, there was something about her that I just, I really wanted to add her to my collection. I just think she's beautiful. So I think these three are some of the prettiest dolls in my collection, to be honest. Even though, really, I'm more of an anime fan. But, I mean, these three together are just gorgeous. So, alright you all, that's my group. So, I hope you have a nice night. And I will talk to you later. Let me know if you have any questions about their clothes or anything. Um, I will try to answer as best I can. Except for shoes. You know the rule. They're all like... Amazon, AliExpress, Rando shoes. I do have some Danny Chu shoes though, just so you know. And uh, I can include that information as well if you need it. All right, talk to y'all later. Bye.